All right, Cole Thompson, uh, we, we've been talking to him quite a bit uh, recently here, but uh, obviously when you ride like that and you get out there and take these championships, we got to talk with him yep. again. Cole, man, uh, let's talk about first off, we know you won. You were very difficult to beat in this, uh, obviously. I did see you look over your shoulder once, though, to see yeah. where the guys were. You were actually Had checking. to. Had to. The guys were uh, pushing me hard this last weekend. Uh, new faces at the front, and it was good to see. Uh, a lot of the guys this year in the series had gotten hurt, so always good to give uh, some of the other guys uh, an opportunity. Thankfully, I stayed healthy all season and able to get uh, the clean sweep on Supercross. Now, I know uh, yesterday there was, uh, or last week too, the, the section that was really kind of separating you from everybody. Were you doing anything different this time, or was everybody kind of no. doing the same thing? I think this track was just limited for what you could do. There was a couple different rhythms, but everyone knew the fast lane. Um, I think it was like on, off, three, two. And then through the whoops, because the pad was turning right after, you had to turn right after the whoops, you couldn't skim them with speed or else you'd end up in the other lane. So kind of tricky, really, because you weren't uh, able to skim the whoops quick, and there wasn't a big rhythm to uh, make up that second or two like I was last week. I'm all right, well, um, obviously we all had you picked to win this thing coming in, but uh, so, and you did just that. Uh, yeah. So congratulations Thank on that you. to you and Thank the team you. and everything. What, uh, I mean, my question for you is, what's next, man? What is next for you? I don't know, get home, uh, get the Xbox fired up, uh, <laughs> get some Formula One on the TV tomorrow morning, and uh, go from there. I don't really know what's next. I'd like to do Supercross, I stated that, I think almost a year ago now, I want to do Supercross for 2022 and when it comes back to a full series. Try to make that happen any way possible and uh, go from there. Now, just to clarify, are you talking AMA? Yes, correct. Yeah, AMA series. Um, last season I did, that was, uh, a, I'd say full season was 2016, 2017. Did four rounds and then uh, I got hurt and then I wouldn't be, or I wanted to do it the last two years, just never worked out. So 2022, make it a goal, try to get things lined up and uh, start riding Supercross right away. Wow, well, I think I speak for everybody here in Canada when I say, yeah, you should, because uh, man, you still look so comfortable out there. Thank you, yeah, no, it was, <laughs> it was fun. Fun weekend, uh, no rain, can't complain. All right, Cole, well, uh, again, congratulations. Uh, who would you like to thank? Just gotta give up the whole KTM Red Bull Thor Racing, Parts Canada, my mechanic Steve, my wife, Oakley, everyone that backs us, thank you. And you know, you can't get a head start for November. Right? You got to start I know. clean. No, it's coming off. Actually, I didn't. I didn't intend it to be a thing, but uh, people <laughs> took to it on the internet, and then I felt like if I took it off, it would have been kind of 50/50. People are saying shave it. People are saying keep it. I kept it, and uh, I mean, good, good luck. You know, we we led a lot of laps, won a lot of motos, so uh, we'll see if it comes back uh, next year when the Supercross starts. <laughs> All right. Thanks for the chat. We'll Thank see you soon.